Hi, Assalamualaikum. It's me again, Azina Jha. Welcome back to my channel. So if you guys are new here, hi, my name is Azina Jha. Nice to meet you. And today, in this video, it will be a little bit exciting because I'll be sharing with you guys my opinions, my experience, and my reviews on Glowgasm. So if you guys don't know, Glowgasm is a new indie brand or small business beauty makeup brand whatever okay um it's an indie brand here in malaysia logasm is very very new to this makeup industry so yeah it's very new just launched this year i can't remember when but it's just launched and um, their first launch is their cream blush so if you are in the pr list you will get this uh nice packaging of pr box from glogasm so i didn't receive any pr from glogasm or from any beauty products this this just uh my cousin's pr box i just pinjam dari dia and i'm not on their pr list guys i just saw this on my cousin's room and i was thinking of maybe should i do a review or not and my cousin said yes so here i am doing review for you guys since glogasm is very new to the makeup industry so why not if i just shout out to um glogasm beauty to you guys so maybe you guys are interested to try it them on and this is what inside looks like so you will see it's glow day and you will receive a card from glogasm team and then you also receive a cookie jar from them and then there are two cream blush from them Tada! this is their main products by the way all right so if you guys can see right here we have two shades of cream blush so this is what the box looks like very aesthetic very simple elegant just less is more and at the back here it says their ingredient list direction to use and yeah that's pretty much it and also they are described at the back of the box it says awaken your skin in an instant with a depth of natural looking gel blush the formula of glogasm blush paint is highly pigmented to replicate the appearance of happy and healthy rosy cheeks not only is it lightweight and comfortable to wear the long wearing product will stay on your skin throughout the day and well into the evening so we will see about that how it goes yeah they have two shades one is called daisy bloom and one is called crimson wine so we will try both of them so let us talk about their price so each of these blush paint retails for 59 ringgit 90 cent but if you want to buy bundle for both of them retails for 110 ringgit so for 15 gram i mean it's quite reasonable for the amount that you get because it's so big and and you will tahan this for like i don't know several years maybe if you type of person yang memang suka cream blush i mean boleh tahan lama juga lah for this amount of blush paint that you will get because it's like literally size of my my hand here besar lah boleh kata besar juga lah pigmented ke tak we will see about that later on because on the back of the box it says it's very pigmented so kalau dia pigmented then for sure obviously you just need to use a teeny tiny bit of the cream blush because lagi sikit you gonna lagi tahan lama the cream blush and berbaloi lah you bayar the amount of the cream blush so you guys can purchase this on shopee because glogasm also have on shopee and also you guys can purchase it from ig if i'm not mistaken uh, oh yeah, they also have it on their website www.glogasm.com You guys can purchase on their website and also from Shopee because if you want to receive some points or free shipping or whatnot, you guys can purchase it from Shopee I already applied my base, my eye, my lips, my brows, everything except for the blush because I really want to try out the cream blush obviously and i haven't powdered my face yet because i'm the type of person yang if i want to do cream products i will dahulukan all the creams like concealer foundation cream blush cream contour or whatnot so i will dahulukan all that part first and then i move on to the powders hence i haven't powdered my face yet just to 
review this blush pick since they have two colors so one side i will try the daisy bloom and one side i will try the crimson wine so we will see how it goes on the website itself daisy bloom describes as beige peach color with chocolate brown undertone that will give you that dewy and healthy sun-kissed cheeks not only it's lightweight and comfortable to wear the long wearing product will stay on your skin throughout the day and well into the evening so we will see about that and their direction is squeeze a tiny amount on your hand and dab it along your cheeks blend it together to get a smooth and dewy finish we will attempt to try the daisy bloom first so this is how um like i said this blush has already been used by my cousin so obviously you will see all the products that have come out but crimson wine tak ada lagi orang sentuh so this is how it looks like new packaging so i have my blush brush and i'm gonna put this on the back of my hand just a little tiny bit because actually uh, several days ago i i have already tried this blush and it is very pigmented you guys like you really need a teeny tiny bit of the cream blush sebab dia sangat pigmented so i've already put it at the back of my hand and i have my mirror in front of me and we will just try to put it like this i like to put at the back of my hand and i like to apply using my finger to put it on my cheeks because i don't like to Takut dia pigmented sangat if I apply with my brush. So any leftover, I just brush it with my blush brush and also on my hand. So we just la ilaha illallah. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I was planning to do this side. Okay, whatever. <laughs> so. Wait, let me. Uh, I need to remove this side because I was planning to Kan dah nampak blush tu Okay, let me apply another layer of foundation Just to get rid of that color Okay, hopefully you guys cannot see the color. Okay, now it's neutralized. Nice. Um, the foundation that I've used is from Nude Stick. This is the tinted color foundation, and I'm in the shade Nude Tree. If you guys are wondering what shade that I use, so this is um, what is it called? Daisy Bloom. Very pinkish. Um, cause like I thought it would be in the website it describes as beige color, beige peach color. But I don't see any beige peach color. It tend to look more like a pinkish color. I don't know if maybe we should try to uh, put differentiate with this one later on. But so far as I'm concerned, it's it doesn't look any beige peach color to me. It looks more like a pinkish color. And like I said, a little goes a long way. And like you saw how much a teeny tiny bit that I put on my, the back of my hand and this is the result you get and this only like sebelah je if I put dekat sebelah ni pun pun muat lagi pun cukup lagi pun letak like I did just now so a teeny tiny bit goes a long way and it's very pigmented you guys can see right off the back the color it's very very vibrant on my cheeks so we're gonna use the crimson wine on my left cheeks so here we go oh yeah by the way crimson wine uh, describes as gentle shade with a dusty rose undertone that matches all skin tone and gives a dewy and healthy cheeks not only it's lightweight and comfortable to wear the long wearing product will stay on your skin throughout the day and well into the evening probably like that like sumpah sikit gila sumpah sikit Gila. Oh my god I think I put too much But whatever Okay so I'm gonna brush away 
the leftover on my fingers so here we go I think I put too much oh my god I think I put too much okay never mind you guys can also um, control with your foundation brush okay now I can see the difference between both of them and I want to tone it down I want to tone it down this side because I literally put too much so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my Nita Cosmetics powder and just powder on top of the cream blush and powder the rest of the face as well oh wow wait, wait. So right now I want to powder the rest of the face using my Nita Cosmetics powder. Tada. You guys can see how pigmented that is. So like a little goes a long way and I ada ada lagi the leftover of the blush paint. All right. So, our thoughts. Do we like it? I think I absolutely love it. Um for the amount that you get and the the performance performance not performance the performance again the performance that you applied on your face is very very worth the price because um oh my god this is very very pigmented and i freaking love it and like i mentioned just now i've already used this blush paint a few days ago and it really stays all day because um i pakai masa i nak pergi kerja masa tu pagi masa pukul 7 and i balik kerja pun the blush is still there even though i didn't apply any powdered blush but the color still maintain there so it's very very pigmented lah like pigmented gila here's about to come down so um i think i love both of them the right off the bat i can already see the difference because masa awal, -awal tadi i cakap yang ini more to pinkish shade kan macam now i can see the difference between both of them i can see slightly difference this one is more um peachy side and this one is more the pinkish side so, all skin tone boleh je pakai both of the shades but um, this shade for the crimson wine is best for a darker skin tone. Color this hangat chanti. And if you have like a lighter skin tone, this will also matches. I mean, both of these boleh pakai to any skin tone. So either both of these can go well on top of any skin tone. So the question is which one yang I like suka? I think I'm more into this one because dia tak terlalu pinkish dia macam very natural kind of look you know because yeah i like more natural blushy tone rather than pinkish tone so that's just on my preference the price is very very reasonable and the amount that you get the upper the pigment that you get once you put it on top of your cheeks is very very well performed i would say Dia sangatlah berbaloi dengan harga yang you bayar. Like you barely put just a little bit and it goes beautifully. Look at the difference and look how I blend on top of my cheek. So you really need to blend quickly because it really dries on fast. So once you put it, you terus blend sebab you tak nak that color like tempeh dekat you punya pipi tu. So um it is very pigmented like i said um what else since this this company is very new to the beauty industry they also launched um a bag and a few stickers glowgasm tote bag for 19 ringgit 90 cent so yeah i mean it's very cute hopefully this brand can go further on expanding their beauty products like cheeks eyes brows foundation concealer anything that would expand your beauty products so 
I think this product is a 10 out of 10 would recommend for you guys so if you guys haven't heard of Glogasm before you should check them out on IG they also have on their website and also you guys can purchase it from Shopee to get some benefits of free shipping and I think that's all from this review um, let me know if you guys want to know more about other products that I I'm willing to review on and I would lovely to do it for you guys. So with that, I see you guys on my next video. Bye. Assalamualaikum.